doesn't look so steady. It'll hold. Pathfinder, if you don't make it in time, could you give Cash my love, please? <laughs> don't be stupid. Of course we'll make yeah, it. Yeah! <laughs> what did you just say? <laughs> Wait. Uh, oh. I said love, didn't I? I'm gonna rescue him, and then I'm gonna kill him! Yeah, 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 I don't blame you. Are we trying to go this way? Whew. Up to there? Yeah, this is fun! Whoa! Dangerous! This is a dangerous place. Oops! Form signal is closer. Can I just invisible again? That's right, I have energy drain. I should probably leave. Yeah, it ain't gonna work, guy. Back in my day, Krogan asked for permission before they went in and started court. <laughs> they didn't just hop into things without the proper clan traditions. Kids these days, no damn matters. No, I know, man. Just tell him what when we get him. When we get to him, we're gonna we're gonna tell him what's up. You have terrible. You 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 handle a gun oh. like an idiot. Get over here so we can talk. I don't think so, Krogan. Stealing a transport was just step one. We're gonna destroy everything you care about. There's only one thing getting destroyed here today, and that's you, and this place, and also your <laughs> boss, and probably your entire crew. <laughs> so a lot of things are getting destroyed here, actually, and all of them are yours. <laughs> don't we mind find me. Born. Then the transport, then I deal with a roll. You never mentioned Vorn before. Eh, <laughs> clan botanist. Kid's real good at making things grow. But he has no survival instincts at all. Miracle he made it to adulthood. Mm. Well, he had to have uh, passed the right of the rite of passage at some point. Dang. Come on up. Oh. 
25,000 credits. Boy, they're just shooting at the door. So far, it's not doing much. I think you're getting closer. Uh, this way? He's like right above our heads. Oh, the door. Okay. Hmm. Born's comm signal is up there. I was kind of worried the he might betray us. Right. Wait, my right, your left. Oops. Uh. Forgot that I didn't change my profile. Uh. Let's pull out the assault rifle. a new-ish assault rifle. Over here. Over here. Krogan I've ever met. Uh oh. Watch out! Uh, no! no! Mm. That could have gotten you killed. It was a reflex. But it's okay, I'm fine. What were you thinking? Why would you do something like that? He was going to shoot you. The colony can survive just fine without me. But without you and what's in your full head, there's no <laughs> future for our people. No. He cares. You're always talking like you're expendable, but you're not. We need you. You're not just some old soldier. We know what we lost because you lived it. Hmm. I need to get some stuff before we go. You talk to him. Uh. Giving everything for your people takes a strong will. Kid doesn't get I have to put my life on the line sometimes. Doesn't he have the right to take the same risks for your sake? Quads, not you two. Nah. We don't have time for this. We have a transport to get. I'm ready to go. You, you stay right here. I'm not telling Cash you died like an idiot. No. Yeah, this'll do. Incoming! <laughs> <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Tricks my favorite. The seat bolt is still on the transport. I hit. Hang on, I'm sorry. Let me let me change to. The locks before they caught me. Good thinking with those locks, born. Thank you, sir. Don't get too cocky. You still got caught. Yes, sir. <laughs> Actually. Maybe I should have stayed with the other one. I thought I was. I thought they were gonna rush us. Oh well, I didn't need to shoot you. Oh, let me get my. I need to. I need to go back to the previous profile so I can see the enemies. Right? That was the right one, right? Yeah. A Solarian! Did he die standing up? I think he died. Look at that. He died standing up. That's creepy. What are 
the Solarian here. This has much farther reaching consequences than we anticipated then, perhaps. Transport taken off yet? Or I mean, I assume it hasn't, but I assume it would actually. Looks have. like a mech suit. Where? Not gonna be much use to anyone in that condition. Okay. Oh. Yeah, it's wow. Wait, what? I thought we told him to stay back. Never mind the bounty, just kill them all! Where are they coming from? Hard to get a good shot in this rain. <sighs> nope, I meant to do that thing. Asari was called. For now. Why is the sharpshooter running in? I can't. It's too close. Crap. I think they're letting Why can't up? I use my turret? Too soon. Finally, something I can sink my rounds into. Ah, I suck. Switch profiles. And weapons. Yep. 
can't do it yet. Wow, the fire rate is a lot hot here. Take care of whoever's up here, is he? You're annoying. Sounds like a plan. That was intense. How's it going? Figure things out? So were we able to save the... Looks like we're done here. Seeds? Don't move. You. Uh... I'm taking this transport. You're going to get yourself killed if you do this. Like I'm not dead the moment that crazy old Krogan gets his hands on me. Oh. I'm not the one you need to worry about right now. <laughs> I have a bad feeling. <laughs> the writer's smiling. <coughs> I'll just wait. I'll okay. just... <coughs> Is it deadly? Should we move back? Wait, wait. Don't come any closer. It'll affect anyone who isn't Krogan. It's pretty strong stuff. Time to take out the trash. <laughs> My first live specimen test. Doesn't last long, but it sure works fast. <laughs> <laughs> My first lab specimen test. Uh, hey, this is from the you, you wouldn't dare. previews. Okay. Did you really just say that. No, no, no. Wait, no, no. Don't let me go. Uh. <laughs> I don't think we need him personally. I kind of just want to drop. Usually I'd say he might be useful, but uh I don't know. What do you I don't know. What do you guys think? <laughs> I should probably keep him, but I really want to drop him. So uh you think I'll drop him? Your call. We can get to spender on our own. Uh, I know things. Uh, you can't do this. Uh, or we can pretend to drop him. I can him. do whatever I want to do. Well, that's that. <laughs> oh, that's so tricky! In the previews for Let's the game, it looked like a Krogan was going to drop a rider. But no, that was a... Uh, it 
it was Ryder sitting with, with Drac, and we were dropping somebody else. They're not expendable, Drac. We are not having this conversation. <laughs> No harm in hearing him out. He's like, no. I please. hate you all. <laughs> you old and cranky in peace already. I hate you. Oh my gosh, Dragon is the best. I mean, the old and Thanks cranky. Thanks for helping peace. me get the colony transport back, Ryder. Of all the stupid things. That's life on the frontier for you. At least we don't have to worry about a roam anymore. That wasn't honorable. <laughs> He looked pretty taken care of down there, yeah. <laughs> he sure did. I can't wait to nail Spender to the wall. Sooner or later, we'll take him down, just like our own. Hopefully sooner, I have plans for him. Oh, listen to me, Ryder. You've been around me long enough to realize this. The fact is, I'm a relic, a symbol of the past, when Krogan were bent on destroying themselves. Fighting, killing, it's all I know. For my clan, for Kesh, to have a real future? Maybe it's best I'm not part of it. Your clan needs you. And so do I. We need to look out for each other. You say that now. Just remember who you're encouraging. Oh, okay. I hope that doesn't go badly for us. Maybe we should have kept our own alive, but I don't know. I don't know. I'm kind of just... I don't know. Usually I would totally go with a more paragon -y route, but... I don't know. I, my, my patience level is nil with these guys. These guys who just want to destroy the Krogan just because? It's like, no. Well, we have, like, you can see the difference between... Like, there are... The Krogan used to all mostly be, like, Drac. But now they're... They're, they can have botanists, they can have geneticists, they don't have to all be like these like ruthless killers, you know? Like, it's good. It's good for them to be able to do so many new things, you know? So, I don't know. Um, I don't know. I, 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 I see where Drac is coming from, but they, the Krogan will always be good fighters. I don't think I properly thanked you for the rescue back there. So, thank you. Helping out the colony was good enough for me. Drac threw his lot in with the right person, then. Hey. So, you and Kesh. Yeah, we actually knew each other before we came to Helios. But it wasn't until we worked together on the Nexus that we really got close. She's... I really <laughs> care about her, Ryder. Drac doesn't hate me, does he? Mm. I'm right here. <laughs> I don't. Actually, I have a favor to ask you, Ryder. Okay. What kind of favor? Well, I, uh, developed a certain kind of flowering plant, and I might have named it after Cash. <laughs> I was thinking, the next time you're on the Nexus, maybe you could give it to her from me? I wonder if this is mutual. Seriously? <laughs> Seriously? You yeah. are adorable, Vorn. Turn <laughs> it over. And you're me adorable, me Vorn. Couldn't grow on Tachanka, but has a new life here. Just like us. Ah. What are you working on in here? Mostly developing hardier strains of Milky Way plants, so they can survive here. Mixed results so far. Fruit-bearing plants seem to do the worst, unfortunately. At least with a vault online, my job is a little easier. Uh, I, didn't, around, I don't Warren. think the vault's online. Come back soon. For getting sure, anyway. Pathfinder, thanks for rescuing Vorn. You're welcome. These blue Does mushrooms bring out your complexion. Him? I don't know how I'd live with myself. Just be careful, Hark. Yeah. Learned my lesson. Know anything about those crazy plants out on the dunes? The red ones? Well, there used to be a lot more of them. What do you mean? 
You see all those red banners outside? The red paint on the walls? <laughs> yeah. The crushed leaves make a perfect dye. Other than that, not much use. Pretty to look at, though. That's how they did it. How's research going? Slowly. We're fine on Elodin, but plants aren't. They need a better defense against the elements. I want to experiment by crossing vegetation and the native animal life on Elodin. Yeah. I was like, fun. From what I've seen of the wildlife, those will be some exciting plants. <gasps> now I just need to convince Vorn. He thinks it's too dangerous. Mm. I guess there's a chance of breeding carnivorous plants like the ones back home. But it's worth the risk. Carnivorous plants. <laughs> They're gonna remake Elodin into like a Tuchanka. I know. I will. Only, only Krogan are gonna be able to live here. I'm actually, instead of talking to Morta, I'm gonna go back to Nexus Control and see if we totally screwed up everything. I saw the worm out there again. That thing Been out of the Sea of Ataraxia. Right. Might make a good rite of, pas yeah. of passage. Let's go. Is he falling back? <laughs> Probably I'll pick weeds again. <laughs> Quick! Oh wait, no. Okay, just wait. No, where's my, where's my nomad? I don't want to mess up Drac, so I might, if I have to redo it, I will. But I just really wanted that guy to drop. <laughs> I'm not Shepard anymore. Oh, and I think my rider is going to take on more of a, like, she's still like a sensitive type person, but I feel like we're taking on more of a logical, uh, a conversational approach. Not like logic or, you know, just, um. I don't know what the word is. Rider. Pathfinder, you have new email. Mm, do I? Read email from Drag. Okay, let me let me out. Drakes, yeah! Swing my cross on a summer in Kadar port. The bartender's getting to be a friend of time. Friend of mine, and she'll mix you up with something that'll strip paint. Uh, let's go. Let's go to the Nexus. Nexus. Da da da. Cause yeah, we still have. Apparently, even though I got his loyalty, he says we still have part of that. I maybe should have kept him alive. That sets a bad precedent, doesn't it? Mm, to just kill people. <laughs> Dang it. I might have to redo that. I could probably go back to an autosave. Hopefully, anyway. Let's just go. It's not showing the Asari one. I thought it would show the Asari one, maybe. Man, I can't wait to get a model of the Tempest. Put it up next to my Normandy models. They're gonna look so good. Gonna look so good. You know, a part of me thinks that this gets kind of repetitive, but it's a loading screen, you know? Instead of us just staring at a loading screen, we're staring at the ship coming in, which is nice. I would like to welcome our Asari pilgrims to the Nexus. Right. We've had a long journey. 
but we're thrilled that Ark Lucinia has finally arrived. We ask for patience as we find homes for everyone. To those who doubted the future, the proof stands before you. The Asari live, and so does the dream. Okay, ah, nice. There's the hero who made it possible, Pathfinder Rider. Do you have any words for us? Oh, buddy. Uh... I'd like to think my team and I are hitting our stride. We're getting pretty good at this. A confident Pathfinder. <laughs> exactly what we need. We chose well with this one. We all owe Ryder a debt of gratitude. In the meantime, please okay. enjoy whatever <laughs> comforts the Nexus can offer a weary traveler. Excuse me. You are the one who saved us? I am. I owe you everything. If it hadn't been for you, I'd be dead. We all would. Now we have a future. A bright future. You've been through a tough time, but it gets better. There's plenty of good in Helios. I can't wait to find it. I mean, there's bad too, you know? It's a scary place, but uh, there's good things. I forgot we hadn't come back at that point yet. Look at all the Asari around! Pathfinder, this is Nexus Control. I've decrypted the scrambler you found. Yes! Good job. Pathfinder out. Sam? Received, Pathfinder. The scrambler contains all the evidence necessary to incriminate Spender. Yes! Species are at odds as talks break down over a unified curriculum for initiative kids. The Asari say... I wish we could see the kids, you know? This be nice. Been wanting to take down Spender for ages. Over here. I'm sorry, Lana. I'm just trying to boost them around. Uh, Spender, I armed you. Give Calix a chance. Need to take down Tan. What have you done for me? Um, I covered your tracks. You made Calix think you were with us, but you were the one who woke up Morda. We both know you were hedging your bets. Make sure we saw you as an ally. Making sure we saw you as an ally. If we actually did take the Nexus. I didn't choose to wake up Morda. They made me. If I went to your boss with, with what I've seen, you'd be out of a job. Hell, you'd be in jail or out here with us. So this is blackmail and smart. You get your supplies, Aaron. Just know I'm saving this conversation. Adam, so am I. Drac will want to see this. I was like, speak with Dr ah! Okay, that's right, that's right. He's over here. Let's go. Go faster, go faster. I'm worried about this place if the cats find you. We've got everything we need on Spender. I've been waiting for this moment for nearly a year. Ready? Yes. Let's go confront Spender. No! Be nice to bring his head back to Morda on a pike, you know, as a gift. We're gonna do this by the rules for now. He's Nexus personnel. Addison and Kandros will decide what to do with him. Spoil sport. <laughs> I'm sorry, but that's the way I it's gonna be. I didn't have a choice. Arone said they'd kill me. You helped the mutineers, Spender. That was a choice right there. All you had to do was ask for help. Instead, you put everyone else at risk to save yourself. Please, incriminate yourself further. Tell us everything they made you do. Made what do you, you do? Know, Pathfinder? You weren't there during the mutiny. You're done now, buddy, and with any luck, they'll give you to me. Everything the Pathfinder's saying is true. Here's the proof. A scrambler packed with logs and credit transfers to exiles. This has been going on since the mutiny. He's been altering files, stealing supplies, communicating with them. This is a massive security breach. I can't even begin to fathom the damage he's responsible for. Like your hands are clean, Kandros? We all wanted the Krogan gone. I just made it easier. No, we the didn't. The exiles think I work for them, just like you think I work for you. That's what real politics looks like. 
Right under our noses. God damn it, Spender! The Krogan left. Spender played both sides just to get a promotion. You couldn't have seen that coming. No. No, I was given ample reasons to suspect You were! Something. I just chose not to. You were don't. It kind of is on you, too. I should have acted then, yep. but Tan wouldn't shut up about the Krogan. You're getting a chance to fix this now. Let's start with taking our side when my clan tries to negotiate a better deal with Tan. You need us, and frankly, we need you. You're right. I'll back you up. We'll do it right this time. So, what about him? Uh, jail. We don't want him out and about. Lock him up. He won't be the last, but he'll make a fine example. You're just gonna throw me in a cell? Could be worse. We could throw you off the station. Think about that for a moment. I don't want him- I don't want him with the Thanks, exiles. Ryder. You have no idea how glad I am this business is settled. And we didn't need that other guy. Whee! Let's see what Kesh says. Vorn wanted me to give you this. Yeah, that's uh, right, that's right! Plant? A flower. He says it can grow into Chunka, but it has a new life here. I think he was trying to be romantic. <laughs> Sentimental fool. Spending his time growing flowers. It's a waste of time. Has no benefit to Krogan's survival. He was trying to be sweet. Cut him some slack. <laughs> as bad as he is. <laughs> Did he say how to take care of it? Just give it love. Oh, <laughs> that doesn't actually work. You can't. I mean, that that actually would have been a really good thing to know, <laughs> legitimately. Nothing more for now. Good luck out there. It it's gonna need like how much watering does it need? Does it need sun or shade or whatever? You know. Let's go chat. Oh, we do have to chat with Tan still about the Asari arc. Let's go see if she has anything to say. Yes, Pathfinder? Has there been any immediate reaction to exposing Spender? Of course. The damage he did. That'll scar us for a long time. There's also the crow I've had to eat. Can't say it wasn't deserved. We're all better off without him. Brecker might disagree. His job now includes everything Spender did. Thanks Brecker. ever so much. <laughs> Thanks ever so much. Director Addison. Goodbye, Pathfinder. Brecker, how's it going, buddy? How may I assist? Everything, Pathfinder. <laughs> Pathfinder. Thanks ever so much. Oh, that's so funny. All right, so we talk to Tam. Probably Camdros too. Hello? You can say Pathfinder. anything? No word? Okay. Oh, and I gotta see if I can talk to uh, Sarissa if she's here. Hey, how's it going? Come here. Another arc lost. But the Turians are safe thanks to you. Well done. I spoke with Avitus. He's sharp. He'll make a good Pathfinder. He. Her armor is awesome. One. What did he tell him? The truth. I don't repeat my mistakes. I never knew Matriarch Ashara, the last Asari Pathfinder. What was she like? The best my people have to offer. Powerful, just, diplomatic. I was a dowdy soldier by comparison. I tell myself she'd understand why I... But she didn't think that way. Diplomacy allows compromise. War doesn't. They had very different mentalities, yeah, and I don't think a diplomat is not what we needed in that in that situation with the cat. They weren't gonna they weren't gonna be diplomatic about it. Cora said you fought plenty of battles, that you were the hero of Kirkus. Ha! I survived Kirkus anyway. What happened? The enemy fired artillery at civilian targets. I used my biotics to shield part of a city. I can make a good shield, as you've seen. I lost. Dear friends in that battle, but we saved a lot of people. That makes me a hero. I'll take it. Cora really idolized you. 
Have you spoken since... A little. It's difficult to talk to someone who's that disappointed in you. But we do speak, and more importantly, listen. Reminds me of the days when I had students. Hmm. Now that the Asari Ark is safe, what's next for you? I'll be tracking the Ket through their secret routes in the Scourge and burning them out. Charting the Scourge will help everyone. Some incidental revenge is a bonus. Hmm, okay. That's good. Good luck, Sarissa. That's good. On to glory, Ryder. Thanks, I guess. Let's see. So there's my dad. How's I it going, Cora? I been dropping in at the Pathfinder HQ. It's just... I'm not good with everything yet. That's fine. You're a hero to Apex, you know. I won't disillusion them. Much. Haha, <laughs> thanks! Hey, Ricks. Hey, Ryder. Good <laughs> seeing you, Abydos. Stay safe out there. All right, Dan, let's get it over with. How are things going with Arthas and you? The Asari seem happy just to be alive, but the Nexus is running out of places to put them. I know. The outposts can't come fast enough. What do we do in the meantime? Would they be willing to go back into stasis? After what they've been through? You get to ask them. I see your point. Just double them up in whatever quarters we have. Easier said than done. Good work locating the Asari Ark, Ryder. There were a few bumps along the way, but we handled it. Perhaps it's best I don't know. All that matters is that the Lucinia has returned, safe and sound. Did you have some other business? Hmm... That's all. Thanks for your time. Of course. What about the Krogan? Something I can help you with? That's no. all. Thanks for your time. Of course. Fine. I wonder what my place here would look like. But it's better this way. Oh, okay. Like her place is like a pathfinder? Any logistics updates are due within the hour. Those just minerals and stuff. Okay. I still haven't even talked to Morta yet. That's all right. Mm. Oh, let's talk to Andros. That's right. I want I want clues on the Solarian Arc. Why don't I have any clues on the Solarian Arc? Hi again. Hi. Bye, Andros. Duty calls. You and me both, Pathfinder. Okay. Supply request is in. Half ammo today. Focus on melee. Focus on melee. Uh, nice. Let's go see if I can talk to my brother. I don't think I can, but you know, I think it, I think at this point it's got to be uh, story driven. But some big things that happened. I got the loyalty of Cora, Vetra, and Drac. Oh wait, what? No, um... I don't think I have any memories I can access either. I can't dash, but I can run. Cryo Bay. Oh, so Cryo Bay, that's right, he's in Cryo. Well, sort of. Showdown on Kadara, rivals vie for power on the Exile Court. After a bitter fight with their rival outcasts, I mean, I know Reyes is out there in Kadara, but at this point, I don't think anything's going to change, so there's no point in going out there. Wake up! Wake up, you stupid brother. I want to talk to you. Are you sure you want to do this, Nilkin? I am. Huh? It's for the best. What's for the best? I'm putting Nilkin here back into stasis. The conviction was overturned, but everyone still treats me like a murderer. When Mariette heard the truth. She left me. I just want to go to sleep and wake up when things are blown over. 
Sure. Run away from your problems. A fitting end. Yeah. I think I saw somewhere that someone was like, I want to comfort Nilkin and blah blah blah. I'm like, why? He's a murderer. It's he try he's not a murderer, but he tried. I know there's nothing back here, but it's so pretty. And this is where you wake up. You wake up over here. And the beginning of the game and you go, Pop up! I want some coffee. I mean, it's sort of sensible, but it's also like, it is, it's running away from your problems. He had a reason for it. The, I mean, what he did, did save people, but, you know. He went about it in a cowardly way. He did it just for himself. He's like, I'm not gonna die here, old friend. Well, yeah, they still have like 600 years or whatever to go back in time. Oh, that's right, we're not going to the bar here. Oh, let's go look at the uh, cultural exchange. Hmm? Is that in here? Oh, hi. Interesting place, isn't it? Full of smiles and handshakes. Not many soldiers. Even though when politicians make peace, it's we soldiers who keep it. Uh, the diplomacy should be forefront. We probably spooked them. Given our situation, it's smart to show we truly come in friendship. Though in these times, you should be prepared for the alternative. But names. I know you, Pathfinder. I am Andrachno, a Heskal with the Resistance. Okay. A Ooh, nice! Centuries ago, Heskal were special forces. We defended colonies, passing our training down via oral history. Few remember us today. I came to learn what the Milky Way knows of such things. I heard your father was part of a similar program, an N7. Yeah. What have you learned about the N7 program? Human soldiers who trained on exotic worlds. Arcturus, Europa, Rio de Janeiro. They <laughs> learned to fight in all environments on little food or sleep, to care for their injured, to lead. Is that accurate? Wasn't your father one of them? He was one of the first N7s. He was proud of that, even though he didn't stay in service. Didn't stop him teaching me and my brother a few tricks. So, you carry a little of that knowledge with you, as well as your Pathfinder skills. N7 training would benefit my people. Heskal Ooh. training would benefit yours. Perhaps a few war games. Yeah. Show me how your skills handle the tests of a Heskal recruit. Challenge yourself and teach me. A chance to work with the Angaran best of the best? Absolutely. Excellent. I'll activate our training beacons. Finding them can be your first test. After that, I look forward to learning. Okay, that would be cool! That would be so cool! Battle the remnant. <laughs> Battle ancient ferocious creatures. <gasps> Retrieve sensitive data. <gasps> oh, hi, Jaw. Pathfinder, thank you for arranging my access to the cultural center. Mm, there's so much to study here. <laughs> Uh, it would take a lifetime. I'd enjoy that. All the reading. Yeah! History, science, culture. Get some snacks, settle into that corner over there. <laughs> no offense, but I'm starting with the Asari. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sure. But when you get to Elcor Hamlet, I want to know. Yes! Yes! And we have the Elcor necklace. We're a huge fan of Elcor Hamlet. Uh, apparently. In the year 2157, human explorers chanced upon a galactic gateway, leading to their first encounter with the Turians. Hostilities erupted. However, the governing body in the Milky Way, the Citadel, quickly intervened. 
They brokered a truce between Turians and humanity. Their antagonism faded, and within a few decades, the two species were allies. This outcome illustrates how Milky Way races believe a peaceful solution can be found to even the most intractable disagreements. Mm-hmm. This one will be interesting. It was nearly 3,000 years ago when the Krogan and Salarians first met. War and ignorance this is a strange had decimated image. the Krogan homeworld. The Salarians uplifted them. Rescuing what? the Krogan from life. Oh, this is stupid. The Solarians gave them technology and a new planet where they could thrive. In return, the Krogan defeated a hostile race threatening galactic peace. Tan this totally. is a complicated relationship, but one showing oh, how my species who gosh. still coexist in the Milky Way. Oh, they totally they totally screwed with this entry. Ah. Uh, uh. Ugh. Oh, that's so weird. Hello. Maybe later. Bye bye. I think I already talked to the Turian VI. It's an honor to meet you, citizen of Atroma. My people are the Turians. It will be a privilege to tell you about them. Maybe later. Bye. At your pleasure. Krogan Citadel. This is an image of the Citadel, considered the seat of government for many civilized races in the Milky Way I miss galaxy. it. Here, the Council deliberates on matters of state. It is a champion of the common citizen, eager uh -huh. to help those in need. Oh, this is just... all political institutions in the Milky Way, conflict <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is actually making me cringe. Like, hardcore cringe. Ugh. How's it going? Hello again. What do you think of the Angara? Bye. I'm thrilled to meet a new culture. They're cautious, but I understand why. If someone showed up on our doorstep in the Milky Way, we'd be skeptical too. I hope we can win them over. Cement a friendship. I suppose that's on you, Pathfinder. It's not just me! Thanks. Of course. Ah, oh, I can't handle the... Ugh. The ooey-gooey words. The diplomatic words in there. The political words. The censorship that's going on. <laughs> Ugh. Sorry, guy. I'm sorry. I got stuck. Speed is kind of aggressive. Yeah, let's get back on the Tempest. Jeez. talk with her though. I might have to call this part here though. I know this is, the recording has gone off for a little over two hours. I had a several interruptions though, but um, yeah, I think All systems Judge could use some new ingredients. Ah. Um, yeah, I think I'll call this one here. Sorry about probably the previous one won't have a very nice cutoff point, but it was kind of hard to figure one out at the time. But um, But yeah. Thank you guys for watching. I appreciate it. It's been really fun getting back into things. It's nice to just kind of do main stuff. If I feel like doing some of the side questy stuff later on, I will. Might even like live stream some of it if it's just like grinding and getting some of the side quests done. But getting the main stuff done is fun. Huh. But yeah, anyway. Thank you again for joining me. I appreciate it. And I'll see you guys in the next one.